This is a Rosenbach truck. It's about four hundred and thirty thousand dollar truck, and it was purchased through a, a block grant um, that we, that we were very proud to have, and we got some very key people who actually uh, applied for this for this grant. Miss um, Miss uh, Miss uh, uh, Teasdale, uh, and we also have Dr. Thompson with it as well. So uh, again, this this truck is going to provide coverage for this area out here uh, and also the surrounding areas. This is just another tool to help our firefighters uh, do their job better. Um, it's a brand new truck. Uh, we're very proud of it and we're gonna get to try to get every use out of that we can to make sure that this community stays safe. And again, we can't express thanks enough to Richmond County uh, for the purchase. This is not the first truck that they have purchased. You know, we purchased several trucks a few years ago and it's just adding to that fleet to make sure that this fleet stay up to par and to make sure we got the proper equipment that our firefighters need to make sure that we maintain a safe community. Again, just want to make sure that, that, that you provide them the, the most updated equipment um, because that's just so important in, in a firefighter's life to make sure you got the best of the best. And one thing I would say, you know, my hat's off to both Richmond County and the City of Columbia because they always try to provide the best of the best um, when, when we get equipment. Um, they, they step up to the plate and provide us good equipment. So we're not lacking for bad equipment. So we appreciate that. I think it's very important. You have to always update your fleet because obviously these trucks run a lot. This truck ran probably over 800 uh, calls last year itself just from this station. So it's always important to update your fleet because you want to make sure that you, first of all, you got proper equipment, you got updated equipment uh, that, uh, you know, so you can have replacements. So, it's, it's very important to update your, your, uh, your fleet. I'm Senior Firefighter Gonzalez. I'm the move up engineer uh, here at Station 30, uh, Engine 30. We're very excited to uh, have this new engine. Um, we've had great success so far. It's been in service uh, a couple weeks now, and um, it's been a great truck. Uh, we couldn't ask for more. Um, as they were saying, that we run quite a bit over here. Uh, this location is, is fairly busy, uh, medical calls, fire calls. Uh, we keep, uh, we try to keep the station and the uh, apparatus as clean as possible. Uh, it isn't, this morning it was dirty. Uh, they run all night, they run all day. So uh, every morning we try to keep it as clean as possible. Uh, just it's more of a pride uh, thing more than anything. Thank you Chief Jenkins and thank you to everyone who has come out today. Our firefighters and our fire service is extremely important to Richland County. Even for the cars that are driving by right now, they appreciate the work that our, our firefighters do. So the work that these, these men and women do is really critical to our community. So we were excited to continue and extend the partnership that we have with the fire service to be able to help and provide the grant that has purchased this vehicle. It's going to service this community and other communities as Chief Jenkins has mentioned keeping everyone safe and we just so appreciate everyone coming out and it's exciting when you have the opportunity to christen a new vehicle and we thank you for coming here today. Hey there, Mayor Steve Benjamin here. Thanks for watching this video. Make sure you give it a like right below the video and don't forget to subscribe. Also, while you're here, be sure to check out one of our other videos or follow on our social media platforms. Thanks again and remember, we are Columbia.